Uh, the distributive law of uh, algebraic expression it means that when we uh, multiply a term to a product or a sum, we can actually basically uh, expand using the distributive law. So the distributive law tells us that when we take, uh, if just a recap, uh, if you have not uh, paid attention during lesson, a bracket b plus c. So this is a multiplied to b. This will give us a b. A multiplied to c. This is a b plus a c. Okay. So example, if we do numbers last time, we have two bracket multiplied to three plus four. You also know that this is the same as two times three plus two times four. Okay. Can okay, also the the term basically you distribute these two to the three and to the four if it's a plus. Okay. So based on this question, I mean if it's a minus, then well it's a minus. If it's a negative sign, we're distributing. We distribute a negative sign. If it's a negative a, we distribute a negative a or a negative one. Yeah, if it's a negative sign outside, you treat it as though you are doing a minus one. Okay. So let's look at a. A is quite uh, straightforward. I think if you multiply, uh, distribute a to b minus a to c, you just get uh, a b minus a c. Okay. For for b, right, you are distributing negative a. So negative a will combine with b. That will give you a uh, negative a b. Negative A will combine with C, that will give you a negative AC. Now, you can say it's a plus negative A, or I mean, I just summarize it as a minus. Lah. Okay? Now, in C here, you have a negative sign. So, a negative sign, sometimes I treat it like a negative one. Okay, well, this is as though I'm like a distributing, distributing a negative one to, to so called X plus Y, because a, a one is trivial, but a one is as though it is not there. So you just imagine if a negative sign is as though I'm bringing in a minus 1 to x and a minus 1 to, to y, you can see quite clearly that minus 1 and x, that gives me a negative x. Minus 1 and y, that will give me minus y. Okay? And lastly, similarly for this, I can also treat it as d, which is negative 1 multiplied to x minus y. Negative 1 to x will give me negative x negative 1 to negative y will give me a negative that negative is positive huh? okay so that's all for this example yeah i hope you are okay with me no question any question just uh, let me know okay uh, thank you